In this video, I want to talk about the other programs that are available day one of Diamond Dynasty. We have the starter program, and then I want to specifically focus on the spring breakout program. As always, feel free to subscribe if y'all enjoy the videos. We've got daily videos on the channel, and I'm curious to see in the comments what you guys think of the cards, their attributes for the spring breakout program. And I like that we're starting off with a couple programs, the spring breakout. I think they mentioned we should be seeing something for the Soul Series, so it seems like the program should be getting up updated pre pretty regularly and I kind of like the sound of that but let's go ahead and just real quick start with the starter program this is going to be pretty easy to do and you'll notice I think with a lot of the programs they have this year including team affinity you don't have to complete everything but they have a lot for you to choose from right they've got some moments they've got multiplayer missions single player missions parallel xp missions a few collections, exchanges, and a starter showdown, but you don't have to complete everything. You can really kind of choose how you want to play and how you want to unlock and progress through the programs is what it's sounding like for MLB 24, and I think that's a very good thing rather than being forced to do something. I like having options for being able to progress through programs, but we've got an icon, a banner, a pack, a bat skin and already we see some more stuff the world tour they said this was probably hinting at some future content we could expect and the first card is a new legend we've got some xp under there as well that's something we'll notice today in a lot of other videos just as you play the game earning xp is really done a lot this year by progressing through content they've got a lot of xp just thrown in through the programs throughout the different modes here in mlb 24 but rafael palmero is available in this starter program, 90 contact for him, 80 and 81 for his power. Not great fielding, but he plays first base, 42 speed. Could stick him out in left field if you wanted to. But quite a few quirks on the new legend, Rafael Palmero, for MLB 24. You got another pack, another icon, stadium sound, some more XP. Ball as a habit pack, Marlins uniform right here. Set one headliner, a chance to find this Mickey Mansell, Takashi Okazaki card series. And then if you complete the starter program, you get to 50 points. You get a diamond, this 86 overall, Sandy Alcantara. Man, I wish the Cardinals had somebody like him. But we see the velo up in the top right for Sandy. Good pitch selection as well. We see the control on each of his pitches. That sinker should be pretty nasty. Looking at the pitch break on each of them. 81 hits per nine for Sandy Alcantara. One quirk. He has home body. And that's going to be the starter program here in MLB The Show 24. But what I really want to focus on is the spring breakout program. Now, these are not the only spring breakout cards. I'll talk about that at the end of this video just real quick. But taking a look at the spring breakout program, how you're going to be earning progress. There's some moments as well as an optional extreme moment for nine points. Hall of Fame difficulty using the spring breakout team. You got to tally three extra base hits in one inning off of Paul Skeens for nine points in the program. Four other moments worth three points apiece. You got some parallel XP missions with spring breakout series players, not just the program players, but the series. You also have parallel XP with each individual card in here. 150 for hitters, 300 for pitchers. You've got multiplayer missions, stat missions with spring breakout series players. You've got general missions, not just spring breakout, but total bases with catchers. Extra base hits with first basemen, hits with second basemen, get on base with shortstops, and homers with nationals. And then there is a spring breakout showdown where you got to face Paul Skeens, and you can get 15 points in this program. But you got silver player pack right here. You'll notice again XP under a lot of these, XP throughout a lot of the programs this year. Starting with 85, Kyle Manzardo, first baseman for the Guardians. We see 85 power versus righties, 81 versus lefties for him. Moving on down, we got a Termar Johnson for the Pirates. 85 contact versus lefties, 69 power though. But then 84 power versus righties with only 72 contact. And then 80 fielding at second base, 68 speed for him. Strike zone going to be pretty small at 5'7 for Termar Johnson. And then we have a Harry Ford. I think I might have said Henry Ford in a different video. But Harry Ford for the Mariners right here. Spring Breakout Series catcher. 71-64 for his contact. 73-78 and 78 for his power. 59 vision. 76 clutch. 70 fielding. Solid arm at catcher with 81 speed at catcher. 81 speed's really not too bad. I'm guessing none of these cards are probably going to have any quirks. But we have a pitcher for the Brewers, 
Jacob Mizurowski right here. We see the pitch selection in the top right, four seam slider, cutter, curveball, circle change. 92 hits per nine on the card. The velo on each of his pitches though up in the top right as well. We see the control on each of them looking a little bit scary to go along with that 61 control and the 53 walks per nine rating. And then the pitch break on each of the pitches for Jacob Mizurowski right here. A pack, a ball and is a habit pack. James Wood right here, 87 overall. So we're bumping up the overalls a bit. 102 power versus righties, 86 versus lefties, 34 vision. He could go with that cornerstone captain Byron Buxton team build. 80 fielding, 81 speed for this James Wood center fielder spring breakout for the Nationals. We also have a Colson Montgomery, 79 and 84 for his contact. We noticed 89 overall. So the overalls are going up a little bit as we're going through the program. But again, Colson Montgomery, left-handed hitter, 83 and 81 for his power ratings, 67 vision, 125 discipline, 96 clutch, 98 durability, 82 fielding at shortstop with 83 arm strength and 82 accuracy, and then also 82 reaction, 67 speed, also plays third base. I don't know why I keep checking the quirks. None of these cards are going to have them. And if you get to 100 points in this spring breakout program, the final card is this 89 overall Dylan Cruz. 95 contact versus righties, 82 versus lefties. 85 power versus righties, 80 power versus lefties, 54 vision, 97 clutch, 81 fielding, 82 arm strength, 80 accuracy, 83 reaction, and 85 speed for this Dylan Cruz. Still don't know why I'm checking the quirks on these card. And with the spring breakout series, you might be wondering, hey, where's Jackson Holiday? Hey, where's Paul Skeens? But you might have also noticed that this says spring breakout series it's not just spring breakout program players so i'm gonna have a whole video where i go through these packs and everything like that but let's just go ahead and check out the pack shop real quick and we can see that in the pack store there are spring breakout pack ones and there's a jackson holiday in here 90 overall there's also a Paul Skeens in here. So there's going to be other spring breakout cards. There's going to be other spring breakout packs. And I'm going to have a whole video probably going over the pack store. But there's a lot of stuff right now just in day one here in the pack store on MLB 24. But I'm curious down in the comments section how you're feeling about the first couple programs. How you're feeling about these spring breakout cards from the spring breakout program here in MLB The Show 24. And real quick before I end this video, I just wanted to point out the schedule. We talked about this a little bit at the beginning of the video, but you'll notice coming soon here on the schedule. On the left, we got available now in MLB The Show 24, but we got coming soon in MLB 24. On March 19th, there's gonna be a Soul Series free pack. Also on March 19th, it looks like we get our second of the spring breakout pack. I don't think that one's going to be free. I'm interested to see how the overalls compare in that free Soul Series pack to the spring breakout pack. They did mention that we should be having free packs every week in the show shop. I'm pretty sure that's what they said. Opening day, we're going to have supercharges. And then the egg hunt program is returning on March 29th as well as the update to the ranked program where you can actually progress past 75. If you checked out the ranked program video or you've seen the ranked program at all, you might notice that you can only get to 75 points in that, but on March 29th, you'll be able to start going a little bit further. And that is gonna be it for this video covering the programs, at least to start the year, for MLB The Show 24. I'm curious to see what you guys think. If there's any of these spring breakout cards from the program, you're looking forward to using. Maybe this Dylan Cruz.